March 23rd, 2019. So I get a lot of questions from people when uh, we get into conversations about the farming operation here and they, they always ask, what is a ram pump? So today I'm just going to briefly go over what a ram pump is. A ram pump is effectively a gravity and water powered pump. Uh, so here in this setup we have a, a spring up above the pond. We have a water line coming down, this two inch line comes to a standpipe which basically just acts as a small reservoir for the pump and then it runs down to the ramp pump. We get about six and a half foot of drop from the spring to the pump and we'll go down and take a look at the pump and I'll explain how it works. So here we are down to the pump just down from the standpipe that we were at. This is a ramp pump. Basically, it uses two check valves. I'll shut it off for a second so you can hear me over it. And actually, I'll even take the bucket off so you can see it. So it uses two check valves. And they're set up uh, reverse from a normal check valve where you'd want to prevent backflow of water in a water system. In this case, they're set up to allow water flow until the check valve is forced closed. So water flows through this check valve until it is slammed shut. When it slams shut, that pressure wave pulse pushes through this is another check valve. It pushes through that check valve and is trapped in this chamber. Uh, from this chamber, it goes out to the output line. So on each cycle, we're trapping a portion of the water and pressure that's being produced in the chamber and delivering that to the rest of the system. So uh, usually they run about uh, somewhere between 10 and 15% efficiency. So for every, uh, say, 100 gallons that goes through the pump, you'll get about 10 or 15 gallons delivered up top. This particular ram pump system uses six and a half foot of drop to the pump. From the pump to where it is delivered, it's about 72 vertical feet, and it's about 880 feet distant. I'll give you a quick shot of uh, the water output from the reservoirs up top, and you can see uh, that over time we're able to accumulate quite a bit of water. So this pump works, uh, produces somewhere around a gallon a minute, sometimes a little less. Uh, but basically we can produce about 1,440 gallons a day of spring water delivered up top to the farm from this ram pump for no power input, no gas, no electric, no solar panels, no batteries, none of that. Uh, this is one of the few systems that is completely EMP proof. So uh, we'll go up top, I'll show you the water flow up there, and then uh, that'll be that. And I'll give you a quick shot back of how easy this is to start up. It. It's pumping. Just like that. Well, just to give you an idea how far the water goes, you can see that line snaking up the hill. It goes all the way up that hill, up over the top of that hill, and up to the barn. And you can't see the barn from here, but it's up that way. And so here you can see the overflow from the ram pump, or well from the reservoir. Two 55 gallon drums up in the second story of the barn, for now. And uh, you can see that this is running even through the freeze overnight last night. I find anything uh, doesn't go below 27 degrees because the water is moving, we're able to keep it from freezing. Alright, and I'll show you how much water we can deliver on demand from the reservoir. So this is one of many valves that's connected to the system. And we can dump about 20 gallons a minute at any given time. The reservoir. So 
So that's what a ram pump is. If you want to know more, check out the playlist here on my YouTube channel. I go into all sorts of technical details, including uh, how to engineer your own ram pump. Thanks for watching the Pharmacy Seeds Network.